Dispersal of Seeds Plants produce many seeds as new plants grow from these seeds. Not all seeds, however, grow into new plants. Only the seeds which get favorable conditions such as the right soil and enough air and water grow into plants. What will happen if all the seeds that leave the seed pod fall under or near the parent plant? It would become too crowded and most seeds would not get enough sunlight, food, water and space to grow into new plants. Hence, it is important that the seeds scatter away from the parent plant. Some agents in nature carry the seeds or fruits away from their parent plant in a process called dispersal. Agents of Dispersal Dispersal is carried out by the wind, water, animals and by the explosion of fruits. The special structures of certain seeds and fruits help these seeds in dispersal. Wind as an agent of dispersal Seeds of cotton, madar and hiptage are light and have hair or wings, so they can be easily carried by the wind. Water as an agent of dispersal The lotus fruit has a spongy part and the coconut has a fibrous outer covering to enable them to float on water. Animals as agent of dispersal Human beings and animals eat fruits such as cherries and mangoes and throw away their seeds. Some seeds such as xanthium, spear grass and tiger nail seed have hooks or spines. So they get stuck to the hairy skin of animals and are carried away. Birds swallow some seeds which come out unchanged in their droppings. Dispersal by explosion Some fruits such as peas in a pod burst open or explode when dry. The force of explosion helps to scatter the seeds. Subscribe now and press the bell icon. Never miss an update.